Hello, everyone. I hope you're doing great. Thanks for joining us again today. We are Powerhouse Hour, and our mission here is to share the good news that Jesus loves every one of us, and he wants to have a personal relationship with us. And today, Jesus is inviting you again to come and sit and eat at his table to partake of all he has prepared for you before the beginning of times. And that's joy, peace, healing, purpose, victory, and eternal life with him. A table has been prepared for you, regardless of your situation, who you are, what you've done. There's a seat for you at his table. In the book of 2 Samuel, we have the account of a man named Mephibosheth, who became crippled in both feet as a child. He was the grandson of King Saul and the son of Jonathan, the best friend of King David. Mephibosheth was the grandson of a king, which makes him a prince. However, his crippled state kept him away from the palace, kept him away from claiming his true identity as a prince in Israel. However, he was not kept away from the palace forever. One day, King David remembered him and he asked, is anyone in Saul's family still alive? Anyone to whom I can show kindness for Jonathan's sake? When he came to David, he bowed low to the ground in deep respect, and he added, who is your servant that you should show such kindness to a dead dog like me? And from that time on, Mephibosheth ate regularly at David's table, like one of the king's own sons. Friends, I am Mephibosheth, you are Mephibosheth. I was in a crippling state, crippled with self-righteousness, crippled by my ignorance of the word of God, crippled by lack of knowledge and understanding of who God is and what he requires of me. Until the day I accepted the invitation of King Jesus to come and sit and eat at his table. Friends, you may have the use of your physical legs today. However, you may be crippled by questions as to who you are, why you are here on earth, or crippled by the cares of society, you know, challenges, sickness, lack of resources, relationship issues, unable to move forward, living in a constant status quo, no promotion to a higher level. Jesus is inviting you today, come and sit and eat at my table. Surrender your life to Jesus today. Become a son, a daughter of King Jesus and begin to enjoy all the benefits available to you. When Mephibosheth sat at King David's table, no one could see his crippled feet anymore. His feet disappeared under the table. So shall it be for you. Crippling things in your life will be covered. The table has been prepared before the beginning of times and one seat is left empty and that is your seat. Friends, if this good news resonates with your heart, please repeat these words after me. Just say, Lord Jesus, I thank you for preparing a table and saving me a seat at your table. Today, I heard your invitation and my answer is yes. Come into my heart, be my personal Lord and Savior. I ask for forgiveness for my sins, and I thank you for paying the ultimate price on the, color, on the cross of Calvary. 
for me so that I can be forgiven. Holy Spirit, I invite you to come into my life, teach me and make me a true disciple of Jesus Christ. Amen and amen. And friends, if you've prayed this prayer, welcome to the family of God, where you have many brothers and sisters. We ask that you will find a Bible teaching church in your city, in your community, that you'll be connected. Amen. That you will rub shoulder with other brothers and sisters so that your faith may grow. Hallelujah. So that you may grow in the knowledge of this Jesus that we have presented to you today. Please let us know that you have made a decision for Christ. Our email is at help to inspire at gmail.com. You can also contact us via our webpage, which is PHH World, the letters PHH World. Dot com. And you can go on the contact page, fill out your information, and we will get, we will get your, your message, and we will get back to you. We'll love to get to know you and help you in our measure so that you may continue to grow in your faith that you have placed in Jesus today. Please follow us on our social media. You'll find all the de details in the description box below. We are on Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, and Instagram. Please like, share um, this broadcast with all your friends, your family, your colleagues, so that this good news may spread to all the four corners of the world, because everywhere there are sons and daughters who are waiting to be re reunited with the Heavenly Father. There are still seats available at the table of Jesus. And so he is calling out all sons and daughters to gather, to come to him and sit and feast with him at his table. Thank you for listening to us today. We hope you're having a great week already, but go in the peace of the Lord and know that you have been redeemed, that you have a place at the table of Jesus, regardless of who you are, regardless of your current situation. There's a God that has prepared a place for you and he's waiting day and night. Be blessed for now. Bye.